Hello and welcome to another video by Anchrome. Today we are going to learn how to solve a very commonly occurring problem during a routine HPTLC analysis that is a syringe block. Many of the times we get this problem when we are doing analysis because of some minor mistakes of forgetting to rinse the syringe after the application is done. However, today we are going to see how to troubleshoot such a blocked syringe. As you know, the syringe has the following parts. The main body which is made of glass and you have the piston which is actually pushing the solvent when the application is going on. In order to remove the block, first remove the piston. Now, take another syringe which is in working condition and take 100 ml of measuring cylinder. Add methanol or any other solvent which was last used for the application to the measuring cylinder. Fill it till the top with little excess quantity and now with the help of another syringe which is in working condition, carefully fill the syringe with the rinsing solvent. The rinsing solvent most commonly used is methanol. Alternatively, you can use methanol water, ethanol water or in many cases IPA will also work. The solvent may change depending on the sample which has caused the blockage. Now insert the syringe tip into the blocked syringe and carefully push inside so that the inner barrel of syringe gets filled with the solvent which is used for rinsing. Now hold this syringe with the needle tip and carefully tilt the measuring cylinder and place the syringe slowly till it reaches the bottom of the measuring cylinder. Once this is done, also place the piston of the syringe inside the measuring cylinder. The process is now ready for sonication. After we have made this arrangement, the next step is to sonicate for 20 minutes. That can be done by simply using a sonicator at your facility. If a temperature option is available, you can select a higher temperature, but please make sure it is not more than 60 degrees Celsius and the time has to be set for 20 minutes. Simply put the measuring cylinder in the sonicator bath and switch it on. Note the timing, it should be done for 20 minutes. We will be giving 4 cycles of 5 minutes each. Once the sonication is done, remove the measuring cylinder along with the syringe outside and remove the syringe from the measuring cylinder along with the piston. You can do it with your hands or use a forcep. I have removed it from the sonicator with the help of forceps by slowly picking it up from the measuring cylinder and taking it outside. The same is repeated for the piston as well. Alternatively, you can also decant the solution very carefully and then remove the syringe from the measuring cylinder. Once the syringe is removed, Put the piston inside the syringe and now try to push and see whether the block is cleared. If the solvent comes out of the needle tip, it indicates that the syringe is cleaned. You can now use this syringe for your routine HPTLC analysis. If this does not work, kindly contact us at lab at the rate and .in. We will assist you in resolving the issue. Thank you.